Let's get to Jim and stop trading. Piece in, uh, in the paper about in the journal about Goldman and talks to unload GM credit card. I do want to just point out we don't know if this is necessarily true, so I'm kind of unconfirmed. But Goldman continues a pace to get out of these deals. Now they've made it just so you know. Apple reports this week they've made that card into something that actually someone might want to buy. But I continue to like the stock of Goldman Sachs, if only just because they are they are just undoing. I see. I like these companies who undo. They make mistakes. And they change. You're referring and, to Walmart clinics? Yes. Golden these are, cards. These are companies that are, have confident CEOs who say, you know what, this was a mistake and I'm reversing it. And that's why I think that if Goldman comes down, you buy the stock. Because when you get out of these things that are not your core competence, your stock's going to go higher. By the way, uh, Katie Huberty, Morgan Stanley, nice chart today where they upgraded large cap banks earlier in the year. Since then, median capital markets beat was 11%. And they say still relative to nominal GDP, M&A, capital yeah. markets, loans are still uh, they're below the 20 or 30 year average. Look at the 11, 12 multiple. Uh, Bank of America has a very, very low multiple. A lot of that's filled because their their bank, their bond positions, which they can hold in maturity, are hurting them. It's 11 times earnings. I, but I just think that that Goldman is just showing me that if they can unload the, the Apple card, I shouldn't say unload. If someone wants to take advantage of the Apple card, their multiple is going to go up. So just be aware that the banks have real optionality. And, uh, and David, it's all about HVAC. It's all about HVAC. I will keep that in mind. I will do, instruct. The paramount. line is exactly how do you mean. That's the line. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly yes. right. And I would just say exactly that how do you mean? we are in an era where if you are trying to control the climate, you're golden. Okay. Tonight, Quincy. I have Coca-Cola. I have American Express, the and I have um, I, I, and I've got restaurant brands which QSR. Wow, what a show! Well, I work hard to get these guests. Yeah, you took Quincy. I, oh, that I was ouch. big. That's going to cost you. That was big not getting sure Quincy. Uh -oh. It's not about friends; it's about part. It's <laughs> it's really about profits for our viewers. It is. And I'm sorry that I had an outburst about being wrong, but. Our people who watch me are betting on me being right. So when I'm wrong, I have to own that and say it. Jim, we'll see you at six. Can't wait. Thank you.